Everyday Heroes. Brought to you by Hendrick Auto Group. Tucked away in a small shopping plaza on Dorchester Road is a place where you can go and get a free meal or pay what you can for a meal, no questions asked. The idea behind Destiny Community Cafe is to feed people who are hungry for a meal and those starving for support. We went into the kitchen with the founder and took a look at her ingredients for success. Stew chicken. We're doing a cabbage soup. When the pot's hot at Destiny Community Cafe, Touch. wow, look you at that difference. Even a <laughs> meal fight with a knife <laughs> you, you almost... can make a meal and a difference. We can make a different dish with yours. Regina Saunders founded Destiny Community Cafe. It's a place where you eat what they serve, then pay what you can. We'll do sweet potatoes with her cuts. <laughs> that was nearly three years ago. You see, Regina is the owner of Scott's Grand Banquet Hall. She discovered that after she catered events, she would often have pounds of uneaten food left over. So rather than throwing food away... You know, the food is good, it's healthy, flavorful. She hung a sign, put on a new apron, and offered free meals to anyone, no questions asked. A lot of people like to say, oh, that's Regina, she feeds the homeless. I'm like, no. They're struggling people. I mean, some people could just struggle for just that week or just that month, and they come in here and humble. You know, we don't discriminate. We don't even know who that person is unless they tell us. No one who works here is paid. Her family and friends have been voluntold what to do since day one. Sometimes I'll be here, and I'm like, I don't know who's going to come help me today, and they'll show up. Um, ready to cook. I bet you've heard a lot of amazing stories. Um, I had a lady caught two buses to get to us. She was living in a hotel. And I had one guy, he literally opened up a yeah, a quart Ziploc bag with all these medications and lined it up on the table before he ate his meal. We'll have a table over there with like 10 kids sit around the table and they bring me a handful of change to put inside the donation box. We got two of them in here. She depends on the kindness of farmers, restaurants, food banks and pantries for food. So she has to be flexible on what she can whip up and cafe guests have to feast on what's fixed. I had an older lady that never had a rutabaga before and she had her first rutabaga here and loved it. We cook what we can, they pay what they can. I'm Regina Saunders. Clarence Porter. She loves when new people stop by. This is Destiny, pay what you can. We're the only ones in the state of South Carolina where people can pay what they can afford for the meal. And encourages them to spread the word about the spread. Regina Saunders believes Destiny can Community Cafe is destined to do more. What do you envision or do you have something down the road you see for this? We want to be able, of course, to have a menu, maybe hopefully get a regular donor sponsor to help us get inventory. And we want to go mobile. Our goal is to try to get funding so we can have a little mini fleet of trailers to go out and set up shop for an hour or two in some of the communities where we know the people really need to get that hot, healthy meal. You've been described, and I was um, given your name because someone said, you know what, talk about a hero. This girl is a hero. I'm thankful that I have my health to, and my hands to be able to do what we can do. And I'm telling you, I think the hero are a lot of the people who come in here and um, humble themselves a lot to come and eat and, you know, and tell people about us. I love seeing people enjoy our food. If they don't enjoy it, then why are we here? Well, if you would like to have a meal at Destiny Cafe or if you're interested in volunteering, Destiny Cafe is open Monday through Friday from 1 until 3 o'clock. It's located at 5060 Dorchester Road, Suite 320.